Hi my loves, thanks for returning. I hope this video finds you happy and doing well. As you know by the thumbnail, this video is going to be all how I snatch, sculpt, and smooth this body. <laughs> so if you're interested, then just keep watching. All right, so before I get started, I wanna get a little housekeeping out of the way. If you're a returning subscriber, I love you. Thanks so much for returning. If you're new here, I am Bridget. On this channel, I do skincare, makeup, with a little bit of lifestyle sprinkled in. So if that's your cup of tea, please consider subscribing to my channel I'd love to have you join the family all right so let's just talk about all this shall we um, this is gonna be a really quick video I just want to talk about some items that I like to use to really smooth out my lumps and bumps I wear a size 14 in pants because I have a really big butt and legs um, if I wear a dress it just kind of depends on how it's made I can wear anywhere from a medium all the way up to an extra large so it just kind of depends and the reason that depends is because my upper body isn't as big as my bottom part. I got a lot going on at the bottom. So I am 5'7", and overall, I would say that I'm on the bigger side of uh, women by no means if you were to look at me down the street you'd be like oh that's a small woman no i'm a i'm a, a bigger woman but anyway hey so i will have timestamps below because i know you all like to skip around that's perfectly fine um i'm not going to go into details about uh what uh the material is made out of and things like that the really simple things because i feel like when you go to order it um you can really see that but i am going to tell you what i like about the product what i like about the shape and what I don't like and what I think uh, you may like and so on and so forth and I will have the sidebar coming in where I'm actually modeling um, uh, the shapers under uh, nine or unforgiving fabrics you all know ladies the kind of fabrics that um, they're really thin and they they blow in the wind you all know those kinds so just so you all can really see what it would look like now I am not brave enough to just wear these shapers and and panties and things like that by itself you know I know some women do it I'm not brave enough maybe if I was a little bit more toned or something like that I probably could all right so now that I have all of that said I do like to waist train and I just feel like if you are a person that likes to wear shapers or girdles or or bands or whatever it is can kind of help your body along if you get a, a waist trainer of any kind they have millions and millions and millions and millions and millions and millions and millions out there you know really just pick one and you know just go ahead and start your journey that way when you go to put on your shaper your body is not confused your body's like oh she wants me to go in this way and do this this way I know that probably sounds a little weird but I have two by what ways one of them I talked about in a favorites I think a couple of videos back and it's a long band and it actually looks like this I got it all rolled up and it it um you wrap it around okay you see how long uh, okay i think you all get the picture it's very very long and um if you look at how you're supposed to waist train uh they say now i am not the master of this but these are just some things that i've read and seen that you're only supposed to do it for two hours at a time and then you just kind of gradually get into it but you're not supposed to sleep in them now um when i wear them i wear them pretty much during the day and then of course i take it off at night um, another one that I have by what waist is this defined band and you uh, zip it right here you zip it and then um, it's it's a velcro uh, part right here a belt and then you tighten it up and I'll put in a little screen of how it looks uh, a picture of it so you can see how it looks and again you don't have to pick what waist you can pick any kind I think Amazon has them you know a target I'm gonna do another video talking about others that I have and what I like about them and my experience with them but again if you are gonna have shapers okay it's a good idea to waist train so you know it won't be such a shock to your body once you go ahead and put on your shaper okay so let's get into the first one that I want to talk about and this is by maiden form and I have to say that this is probably my favorite one this is what it looks like and you can actually see it better um, in the in the other screen but what I like most about this one is that on on the legs 
the leg part this part, of, this part right here, it doesn't dig into your skin. Historically, when I've gone to wear um, shapers like this or girdles, or whatever you want, however you want to call them, but it's really a shaper. Um, this part will dig uh, in my in my fat on my legs, and that is the worst. And I don't like that. I don't know what kind of sorcery they have going on right here uh, because it's very smooth, as you can see in the dress, and that dress is super tight. Um, and on the leg part you, you can't see the invention one of the items that I'm actually gonna show you all when I have it on you can see the the little invention but um, on this one absolutely not you cannot see it now with this particular shaper um, even though it looks like this part will cover up uh, your bra it doesn't it kind of uh, covers up halfway so by no means is this a bra up here there um, it doesn't have a bone you know how some shapers have a bone this doesn't have one and anytime I get a shaper I like to size up this is an extra large and the reason that I do that is because historically if I've had if I have any type of shaper and I get it in a large it's so stiff it's so hard to get on and even if you size up don't think that it's not going to give you the support and things that you want because it definitely does do that this one is so smooth guys and even where you see the seams on the shaper you cannot see it in the dress also at the bottom it does have like a little thing where you can use the restroom now I know some people are like oh no I can never use that what am I gonna do with that da, 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 da. but if you can't but if you find yourself in a buy oh yes ma'am you're gonna use it but when you get home you just clean it you're supposed to clean it when you get home anyway <laughs> Because <laughs> if you go out with this bad boy on, you're you, you going to be sweating a little bit. Not because it's hot, just because your body is like so, com, you know, conformed and tight. I don't know. At least that's just my thinking of it. But ladies, when you find yourself in a bind, you can, you, you can use it. You know, it might get on some of the fabric a little bit but you know take the tissue and you know get it off as much as possible and then wash it uh, when you get home so i just say that when you find yourself in a bind this is like a, a lifesaver but yeah this is definitely one of my favorites all right so next up i have a shaper um, and this is by um, honey love i don't know the proper name i will put it up on the screen and i'm sure you all are familiar with honey love because honey love is all over the internet and this is the shaper that i actually have okay and in the uh, shot that i'm showing you i did put on another honey love top and this is just a tank right here and this this is what it looks like so let me go ahead and talk about this one the pants right here so this particular shaper that I got is in a size large and it takes a lot to get it on but once you have it on you are not you you're not gonna jiggle you're not gonna move you are going to be snatched in place this is another one that has a little opening at the bottom this also has straps but when I use it, I don't use the straps. I don't find it necessary because it does have bones, a uh, little flexible bones right here on the side. So I never have issues with it rubbing down. And it also has a seam like a uh, give right here for your hips and your butt so uh, once you put it on you can still keep your shape you know how some shapers when you put it on it just flattens you out and it doesn't look correct but this is really good now when you talk about the tank this tank is a size large and this one is something that's really going to smooth you out this has flexible bones too right there on the side and on the back it's a little bit tighter so if you have issues with rolls and stuff like that on the back this would be a really good tank to have and it just has it right there and you can kind of see it in the picture a little bit I was trying to show you and at the front it kind of comes up uh, not not really like a bra but it just kind of looks like it could be a bra okay but yeah let me tell you guys with these these two put together you are not your body is not going anywhere you're gonna have everything all smoothed out now the only thing that I don't like about this one is this one digs into my skin but I know why it's doing that it's because I didn't get it in an extra large so ladies when you're um, getting ready to buy your shapers I know you're gonna be like well I only, I only need a large well no 
get an extra large because you don't want to just kind of make it so to where it's so tedious to get it on and then once you get it on you can't hardly walk you can't hardly bend down because that's how it is in um, this little clip that I'm showing you I am like tight like can't move just snatched if you want if you want a lot of compression okay these two items from honey love I also have another tank I'm gonna show you but if you want a lot of compression I would say to size down although I don't recommend it because it, it, it could just turn out not well but these two items will do that for you all right so next up I have some little briefs by Juicy Couture and I think that these are so cute guys to me these look like little negligee panties because the back is totally see-through okay and then the front um, it has the little crisscross right there where it um, holds your stomach in so as you can see these are high-waisted and I really like that because it comes up almost up under your bra um, and I paired it with this little top this is another top by honey love this one has a little bit more compression in it it does have more support for your boobs and as you can see that crisscross that is supposed to help with your stomach area okay so if you're looking for something that's got really good compression and it's going to smooth you out and keep you in place again this is another one like if you're my size uh, if you have a I wouldn't say to get a large I would say to get an extra large especially if you if you have more top than I have which I think a lot of people do because I really don't have uh, that much boobs all right so the next one that I have is another one by Maiden Form and look at this guys this one is really nice look at how it's cut okay and I really like this one because this on the butt it's really going to come up under your booty cheeks depending on what size you get you are going to see a little bit of a panty line um, as you can see in the clip that I'm showing here now if it looks weird this uh, for this particular shaper it doesn't have any part for your boobs you actually need to wear your own bra or whatever you're gonna wear if you're not gonna wear a bra whatever um, and this one is good because at the back if you like if you have a lot of uh, back fat and jelly rolls see how much that covers on the back all right I really like that that's a lot of coverage so you don't have to worry about um, like if there's a tank that you want to wear and you want it smoothed out now the ones from honey love they do that but it comes down do you see where it comes down like that the difference in that one and this one uh, this one goes all the way up to probably right here you see how high that goes up in the back so if you got um, any type of back fat it's definitely gonna smooth it out this is another one size up okay if you regularly like wear a large lot uh, if you normally wear a size large get a size extra large okay and for panties I have these nautica high-waisted panties right here okay I have some other colors but they're not clean right now and the compression is really good what I like about these little panties is that when you wear them when I wear them under jeans or whatever you know how some stuff it'll just kind of roll down on you this one doesn't and it comes up almost up under your bra so these these type of panties go really well under jeans even the little skinny jeans or the tight jeans whatever kind of jeans and you know you don't even have to get the kind from Nautica you could just get any type of high-waisted briefs okay make sure they they are high-waisted and briefs because briefs are going to cover your butt all the way up to that little, little little hip part where it curves down so less of the panty line will show but yeah i really love these all right and last up i have some tanks by skinny girl and they look like this okay um it's a nude pair and i didn't try these on this just looks like a these are just simple tanks okay and these work really well uh, when you want to layer stuff because this does a super good job of smoothing you out now um, will it just totally smooth you out as well as the honey love uh, those honey love uh, tanks are going to kind of snatch you in place if you're looking for a super super uh, compression but if you're having like a casual day or um, casually at work and you want something you want some compression but you still want to be 
really smooth and comfortable. These little tanks by Skinny Girl um, would, you would absolutely love these. All right, so that's pretty much it, short and sweet. Those are all of the items that I like to smooth, curve, and snatch my body. Let me know down in the comments what items you like to use to kind of smooth and curve your body out. I would love to hear about it. Thank you so much for tuning in and until my next video, smooches.